Hi guys, today I'm working on a mixed media piece of a bull elk using Inktense pencils and blocks. I have links in the description to the products I'm using. Sorry about the bad angle, still trying to get a good setup going on here. I started out by blocking in the underpainting using a number five round brush. I mixed my bark brown Inktense blocks with water in my palette to create light washes letting it dry completely before adding more layers. As I lay it down, I'm being mindful that my brush strokes are going in the same direction as the fur in my reference photo. I start light and build up to the darker areas in the fur. This piece is an experiment for me. It's the first time I've used ink tints as an underpainting for my colored pencil work. It's also the first time I'm using Blick Bristol Vellum. Here I am coming in with more layers and building up the color. You can see I have my piece taped down to my drawing board. This not only helps keep my edges clean, it also allows the paper to dry flat after being applied with a wet medium. Now I'm coming in with the intense pencils here in a second. I'll use those to add a little extra depth in a few areas. More building up layers. Trying to get those brush strokes going in the right direction. I've even brought in another color that's on the back and near the tail. I believe I was using Willow. Still adding more brush strokes going in the same direction as my reference photo. Even though I'm going to be going over the top with colored pencil, I want to make sure the underlayers have the right direction for the fur. You can see my ink tense chart next to me as I was comparing. Oh, bam, there she is. There's my daughter. Well, her knee and her shoulder anyway. She forgot I was filming. <laughs> Life is a mom. Yep, adding more and back as I was saying before. That's it for now. A little over an hour's worth of work condensed into a few minutes. Please be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you like what you see. Also hit that big blue wolf paw to subscribe so you can follow my journey with this elk. Until next time, keep creating.